students and we had about 75,000 students and in the end of 2020 we have about 100,000 plus students and we became the first sorry the Germany's larger private university so before 2021 our name is IUBH and now our university name is IU International University of Applied Sciences Okay, so these are some of the uh, uh, awards and also membership uh, that we have achieved so far for the past 20 plus years of experience. So again, currently we have more than 100,000 students from more than 106, uh, sorry, 176 plus countries. And these are some of the accreditation that we have achieved so far, as you can see here, we are the Germany largest university ranking for the CHE ranking university. This is, this is uh, uh, accredited by the German government. And then we also achieved the five-star rating system for our online learning. And we also achieved the FIBA premium sales, you know, from FIBA uh, accreditations organizations. And also we are the member of AACSP, Business Education Alliance. And we also a member of Hotel Schools of Distinction for our hospitality program. And we are also a membership of the UNESCO, as you can see here, AIU. This is for the Indian uh, Association of Indian Universities. And we also membership of WES, World Education Services, which means that our program, if you study in our university and get our degree, you will be able to continue your study and also apply for a job in the US and Canada. Okay, so and the other one is also a Business Graduation Association member as well. And as you can see here, we achieved 96% recommendation rate by our students as well as our alumni. Okay, so what makes our university stand out? Number one is the flexibility. So our students uh, uh, have the flexibility to choose if they want to study online, on campus, or a combination of both words. And then uh, you can study our bachelor program, master program, or MBA program. And again, as the uh, University of Applied Sciences, we are very career focused and we are very proud that 94% of our graduates are able to find job within the first six months. And then we also have our own uh, innovative learning platform and tools with synchronous and asynchronous elements. So we have our own digital you know, uh, platform. We call it My Campus Platform, where every student will get an, uh, a unique ID and access to use this uh, My Campus platform. And then uh, also our university is globally recognized with multiple accreditations and awards. So these are the two locations that are available for our international students to come and study with us. So first is Berlin, as you see here, it's a beautiful, you know, a capital city of Germany where you will be able to experience like a metropolitan capital city, a lot of historical and cultural sites, bar, uh, student associations, club, restaurant, and also Berlin is the international business hub as well. And even though Berlin is a capital city of Germany, but the living cost here is very affordable for international students. I myself originally came from Indonesia and I live now in Berlin. And I have to be honest with you that for the first time when I came, when I moved to Berlin, I was very surprised because the living cost is very affordable. Yeah, so feel free to come and join to study with us in Berlin. And uh, if we have time, maybe later on, we can play a, a video of our campus. And the next, the next location is in Bad Honef. So uh, Bad Honef is more like a typical, beautiful, a uh, picturesque spa small town in the uh, NRW uh, state or province with all of the amenities such as sports club, student society, and everything is within walking distance. And uh, Barhonev is actually very close to Cologne and Bonn, which are I'm sure you are more familiar with, 
and you can always take your regional train so you can commute to Bonn and Cologne with your friends, you know, to, you know, to, to, to dine in or to see some concerts. So, you know, pretty much you can enjoy also your life as a student, even if you live in Bad Honet, because distant wise, you know, are very close to these two uh, bigger cities. And also in Bad Honef campus, we offer a shared apartment that are fully furnished with uh, shared kitchens and bathroom. So every student will have their own room, but they have to share kitchens and bathroom. And the rental uh, room also is uh, quite affordable. So per month, uh, approximately 430 to 500 euro, but this is already all inclusive with the internet, electricity, hot water, and everything inclusive. So uh, you can also book of this uh, accommodation in Bad Honef with the help of the uh, expert educations. And then you can also see some of the uh, dormitory photos in Bad Honef later on. I will share you this uh, PowerPoint presentations later on. Okay, so the benefits of studying in Germany as an international student, of course, you are allowed to work during your study. So you can work for 124 days per year or 20 hours per week. And then there is also a stay back option. So after you graduate, you have the option to stay in Germany for the next 18 months. So when you study, you focus on your study and then after you finish, and then you can you know, uh, apply for the stay back option or we call it job seeking visa where it will allow you to stay further in Germany for 18 months and you find a job, yeah? But if you don't want to, that's fine. You can also go back to your home country or go somewhere else, but this is a, a very good option that most of our international students are uh, taking this opportunity. And then even uh, you are able to apply for permanent residence under certain circumstances after two years working and living in Germany. Okay, so uh, we also have our career support in our university. And we are very proud that based, of, based on our alumni survey, 70% of our graduates have managerial experience in their current job. And 72% of the, our graduates work in international environment. So for example, like in Berlin, because this is a, a capital city of Germany, like, you know, international city. So you can always find, you know, a multinational company where, you know, you can apply for a job after you graduate or even during your study, you can apply for internship with some of the companies, you know, in Berlin or when you go to Bad Honef, you can always find, you know, a, a multinational companies you know, with in Bad Honef or in Bonn or Cologne or in the surrounding cities as well. So our uh, IU career services, we have like career talks that we have it every week and then career preparation training, which is a live session weekly or bi-weekly. And then one-on-one -on -one career advice, you can make an appointment via, via email and then we can have like a Zoom, you know, a call with you. This is on demand. So you have to email our uh, team. And then application document check if you want to know that your CV, you know, has been properly, you know, written, your cover letter, your LinkedIn profile. So if you want our team to check, you can always send, uh, you know, this document uh, to be assessed. And then we also have a job teaser platform. So this is available in your My Campus platform 24-7 online. You can check if there is any internship opportunity you know, or a project. So anything that you can find in this platform and also career coffee shots that we arrange monthly with our business partners. So again, 95% of our graduates are employed within six months. So these are more details on, of, on each of the uh, uh, career services that we provided. As you can see there, job teaser online platform, we have more than 130 thousand plus job and internship offer we also have a contact with more than 2700 international companies company reviews from the students uh, tips and tricks and useful links for your job search and application weekly career talks you can also be in direct contact with the companies and recruiters access job and internship opportunity 
on your career uh, preparation training. We will also guide you on your career planning and job search strategy, how to write a good CV on cover letter, interview techniques, salary negotiation, and so on and so forth. And also a monthly career coffee shots with our business partner, like a 45 minimum call with career office team, and then get insight on how to get advanced and also get motivated and in the right mindset. Okay, so this is about the career outlook. So for example, if you are uh, applying for our master in computer science, the career outlook will be, you know, from our career section on our website, you could be either software developer in the field of data science AI, yeah? Or you can also be a security specialist in the field of data science and AI. So you have like a broad kind of like career outlook if you're applying for, you know, like a certain program with us and our career service will help you, you know, to, to, to try to uh, give you a, a guidelines and also support on how are you able to find an internship or a permanent job after you graduate. Okay, and this is a very interesting program. And this is a new program that we launched a couple of months ago. We call it IU Job Guarantee Program. So this is only available for ICT Master Program 120 CTS. So this is our two years master program. So either you can do Master of Science, Computer Science, MSc Cybersecurity, or MSc Data Science. So it has to be a two years program. So within this program, there is also a requirement to qualify for this job guarantee. So number one is you have to be enrolled in one of, one of those three programs at IU. And then you also have to complete your study in the standard study period. So if this is a two years that you have to complete within two years with an overall grade of at least 2.5. So the German grading system is a bit different you know, with the, let's say the American grading system where if you have like a grade one, it's the best and six is the worst, yeah? So here we ask you to have like a, a overall grade, like every semester 2.5. So 2.5, if we convert it to US grading system, as one is the lowest and four is the highest. So 2.5 is approximately, uh, similar to 3.0 out of 4.0. Like this is the minimum GPA that you have to maintain for the whole two years. And then you also have to reach a B2 German language level during your period of study. You also have to complete at least 300 hours of internship and or part-time employment internship, and then participate in employability trainings and workshop and actively apply for a job. Okay, and this will be uh, the, uh, the, the, the support and the guidance from day one from our career service that we are going to uh, dedicate it to, you know, to, to the students who are taking this IU Job Guarantee Program. And from your end, you just have to pay additional 3,500 euro because our career service will help you from day one. It's a different with the normal students. If they don't take this IU job currently, they will not get this kind of like a like an intensive, you know, guidance and support from our career service. Yeah, but for those who apply for this, you pay more, but you get more, you know, support and guidance from us. And then a guided career adventure, police application help. You know, we will help you to craft compelling application documents that will be stand out from the from the crowd. And then we will also give you like a German work experience. And then we will help you to find like an internship, you know, uh, opportunity in Germany. Of course, you have to apply yourself, but with the guidance and support, you know, from us, because we also work with a lot of, you know, business partners in this ICT related industry. So you will be able to get, you know, your internship. And then industry tailored interview skills. We will also uh, prepare you on you know, uh, going for the interview and also setting you up to ace those industry specific interviews. So we will guide you again from day one. And then networking opportunity, we will invite you to a lot of, you know, uh, a company event where you can 
you know, uh, get the opportunity to get a direct contact with a lot of potential, you know, uh, companies that will, you know, later on be one of the employer, you know, hopefully. So we will guide you as well and invite you to all to a lot of, you know, uh, a networking events during your study. Plus, you also have to learn German language because even though there are a lot of multinational companies here, but this is a Germany and, you know, people speak German here. So it will be, you know, an advance for you, a benefit for you if you are also able to speak German. And then, sorry, and the level that we require is B2 level. So a little bit about English language, uh, sorry, a German language proficiency level is there are six levels within German language. A1, A2 is for the basic, B1, B2 for the intermediate, and C1, C2 for the advanced level. So we require you to have B2 German uh, language proficiency level, which is this is the minimum you know, requirement if you want to uh, apply in a German company. And then personalized career guidance. And then also we will, you know, exclusive to the ambition design for ICT tech and engineering enthusiasts. So this program will be your gateway to a thriving career in Germany. So again, this is a very interesting program. I, uh, I get back to the previous slide. So there are two programs. So either you can apply for computer science, cybersecurity, or data science. Okay, so this is a little bit about success story of our alumni. So uh, you can also read on the link that I provided below to learn more about some of our successful alumni. And now let's talk about the on-campus study program. So I'm going to explain about how our, uh, we call it like my study program, how we operate our, you know, uh, uh, my studies program at IU. So we do not run by semester. Instead, we run by terms or by quarter. So every three months. Yeah, so uh, within, within the three months, there are approximately 12 weeks. So within these 12 weeks, there will be uh, 11 week study modules or study blocks and consists of nine week blocks of teaching as you can see here on the green blocks yeah let's say if you start in october so the nine weeks of block of teaching which means you will have a face-to-face -face tutorial classes with our professors and tutors that you have to come on campus and then within these three months you will be taking three modules taking at the time for a deep dive into each subject so every quarter you are going to learn three modules and there will be a nine week blocks of teaching. And then it will be a mixture of in-person and interactive lecture with discussion with your fellow students and a chance to interact also with your professors. And then the two weeks, the other two weeks, as you see here in the blue blocks, yeah, like, you know, end of December or this one, end of March, beginning of June. So these are the two week lecture free period. So it means no uh, teaching, you know, a weeks where you can do your exam and assessment as well as offering an opportunity for you to redo the exam. So you have to understand that, you know, um, this is very important for you to know that in Germany you know, or, or, or in any other German university, you are allowed to do the exam or to redo the exam three times. So three attempts of exam. And if you fail three times, we will exmatriculate you. So it's not only within IU, but this is, you know, applicable in all German universities. So just make sure that you will be able to, you know, to pass every modules within three times, you know, uh, uh, attempt yeah and then again this exam will take place as you can see here end of december end of march beginning of june or end of august and for the whole september month we will have a study break for our international students as well as domestic students okay so this will your weekly schedule look like this is just an example 
Yeah, so you are not going to come on campus every week, uh, sorry, every day, but it depends on, remember, you are going to study every quarter and every quarter is only three modules. So this will be your weekly schedule example look like. So for example, you have a class on Monday, or you have a, and you have a class on Wednesday and again on Thursday. And the rest that you have to study yourself. Uh, remember that we will give you an access to our My Campus platform where you can download all of the materials and then you can do the assignment. You can book for the exam there as well, but there will also be the on-campus face-to-face tutorial with our professor every week. So for the uh, nine weeks block, of teaching yeah okay so this is the campus uh, platform look like yeah so this is a uh, dashboard there is a news organize your study and then these are the remember only three modules within you know uh, one quarter and then you so uh, you can also have like your upcoming appointment if you have you know like a q and a sessions online with our professors that you can also book but remember you also have to come on campus to have the face-to-face -to -face tutorial with our professors. Yeah, so this is this is how our learning materials look like. Could be podcasts, I, uh, video presentations, you know, so you can always download and then you can learn all of you know, this learning material from this My Campus platform. So this is a, a combination between online and also on-campus learning method. Okay, so depending on if you have like Android or App Store, so you can download our My Campus uh, uh, IU Learning apps. And you can also book our free German language on Speaks. This is also, if you, you know, if you never learn about Germany, that you can start from the A1 and then go to A2 and then B1 and B2. Again, this is an online uh, German courses, but if you want to do the offline, there will also be an opportunity. You can talk with our student office and then they will uh, gather, you know, more students if they achieve the minimum numbers that we can have, you know, like a, a specific class only for you guys. Uh, or you can also find, you know, like an offline, you know, German language course, you know, around Berlin or around Bad Honef City. Okay, so again, this is the additional benefits for our campus student. So uh, there is a combination, again, as I mentioned to you, between online and offline, you know, a, a study uh, method. And also our e-learning portal, My Campus, that you can always, you know, access 24-7 for your learning material, assignment, exam, or any information uh, from the career service. And then, a combined live lectures on campus with a modern independent learning tool with post, pod, podcasts, interactive books, multimedia presentation, link in learning, and our tutors and scripts. And then we will also give you access to our virtual library. And you can also use a questionnaire and tutor feedback to assess your progress. Okay, so next I'm going to talk a bit about which program that we are offering in our campus. So these are the list of our bachelor program. So we do have like on campus, we have like four intakes. So January, April, July, and October. But uh, if you can see here, not every programs are available in all intakes, some are only available in October, some available in April and October, but some also available from January until October. And you can see here like which campus are offering this program. Yeah, so you can look at yourself. And then this is a pathway program and these are, you know, aimed for students who do not meet our direct entry requirement to our bachelor program. So they have to do pathway first or we call it student colleague here. And again, this is everything will be delivered in English. And once the students finish this pathway, they will be able to enroll into our bachelor program. And this pathway program are only available either in April or October intake, and again, only in Bad Honef campus. Okay, and these are all the master program will be provided in Berlin, as you can see here. So you have like, 
uh, MSC AI, 60 ECTS, 120 ECTS. So the difference between 60 and 120 is 60 ECTS is a one year master program and 120 ECTS is a two years master program. Sorry, I need to go back to the previous one. So all our bachelor degree is 180 ECTS or a three years bachelor program. Yeah, and then master as such as mentioned, either one year master or two year master. But remember the IU job guarantee program is only available for three programs, master two years program. And then we also have our MBA. We have MBA one year, and we also have MBA one and a half year. So the difference between MBA one year and one and a half year is the one year program is the general MBA, but for the MBA 90 CTS is MBA with specialization. So you can choose either finance and accounting, international marketing, AI, artificial intelligence, supply chain management, and so on and so forth. Yeah, so you can choose either one year or one and a half year with specialization. And then uh, 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 some more of our master program, again, one year for 60 CTS and two years for 120 CTS. We also have a management, marketing management, cybersecurity, international management, and so on and so forth as well as with the specializations. Okay, so these are the program curriculum. Uh, so this is like, you know, example for, let's say you, you are applying for Master of Cybersecurity. So these are the modules that you are going to uh, study. This is like the semester one or two quarters. This is a semester two. Again, so one semester is uh, the same with two quarters, remember, because we don't run by semester, we run it by quarter. So if you see here, if you saw here like a first semester, so it means like two quarters. So let's say if you start in October, you finish in December, oh, sorry, and then you continue again, you know, in January until March. So these are the one semester. And then the next will be April, May, and June, and then July, August, and September. For the second semester and then following year as your second year or the third semester and you complete uh, by end of May uh, the next two years yeah this is this is your uh, your uh, curriculum or the modules that you are going to learn okay so now let's talk about tuition pricing for on-campus students so these are the uh, so we have as I mentioned just now, we have like a four different programs. So we have bachelor program three years, master one year, or MBA one year, MBA one and a half years, and master program two years. So these are the tuition fee after the discount. So every level we have like a, a different discount. So bachelor uh, three years, we have like a 19 uh, Sorry, 19% uh, is, oh, sorry. I think I made a mistake here. I'm really sorry. So bachelor with 25% discount and master with 19% discount. But this is the, the, the right, you know, a tuition, uh, a total tuition after the discount. So for bachelor, this is the price 15,741 euro for the whole three years after the discount. Yeah, 25% discount. And then for master one year with 6% discount. So this is the total price after the discount. And this is for MBA one and a half year, 15,025 you again after the discount. And then for master two years, total tuition fee 14,948. This is for the whole you know, uh, program. So again, this is for the whole three years. This is for the whole one year. This is for the whole one and a half year. And this is for the whole two years, okay? And uh, uh, during the limited time, we also offer an early bird exclusive discount uh, where this is applicable if you pay within 14 days or two weeks after you receive your study offer or confirmation offer. So again, there will be a one-time campus registration fee, 1,500, but during the limited time, you will be able to get a discount. Instead of paying 1,500, you will be paying 750 euro only. 
And then mandatory semester ticket costs approximately 200 in Berlin and Barkonev. This is for covering your public transport in the region or in the province. So if you study in Berlin, that you will travel around Berlin and Brandenburg a region with this semester ticket and you don't have to pay extra. And if you study in Bad Honef, you can also travel to Bonn and Köln and other city within the region also for free using the semester ticket. So this is, um, this is valid for one semester or six months. So every six months you have to pay this amount of money, but this is with very heavily discounted. For example, I live in Berlin. I have to pay every month 90 euros to use the public transport. But you as a student, you only pay 200 euros for the whole six months. So you can imagine, you know, uh, the difference between, between you as an international student and me, you know, living here in Germany. Yeah. Okay. And the pathway program, we also give like 15% discount. So the price will be reducing to 9,720. This is again for students who are not meeting our admission requirement. And for those who are coming to Berlin, they also have to pay 190 euro per year. This is a student union Berlin. So you will get a lot of benefits uh, becoming an international student in Berlin. You can go to a concert with a discount. You can dine in at a restaurant with a discount. You can go to find, uh, you know, to, to, to do uh, in, in, in a certain stores. They also give you a discount. And you can also, for example, you can go to... Uh, uh, a canteen in other university and you will also get a discount yeah so this is a lot of you know benefits for you being an international students here in Berlin okay so now let's talk about the admission requirements okay so for those who are applying for bachelor so of course we are asking the students to submit the higher secondary school living certificate and then, you know, in Burmese and also in, in English. And then we ask for the transcript of record from grade 10 to grade 12 with minimum 50% of overall GPA, copy of international passport, your CV or resume, and then English test. So this is very important because our programs are 100% delivered in English. So you have to show that you have an enough uh, English language proficiency level. So IELTS, either IELTS 6.0 or TOEFL minimum 80. Cambridge minimum grade B, if you studied in a, a Cambridge school, a O level, A level. And then Pearson 59 points with 51 points in each range, or you can also use Duolingo minimum 95 points. And then especially for Burmese students, you also have to uh, successfully complete it, a two years of study at a recognized and accredited university in Myanmar. And then you are also able to apply for our pathway program. This is a one year preparation course focusing on English academic writing and reading, mathematics, economics, business application, history and culture. And then this is a one year pathway program only in Batonev. We also give a special discount for our pathway students. But during this pathway program, the student is not allowed to work because this is still like a preparation year. But then once you finish this pathway and then you apply for our, you continue to our bachelor program, then you are allowed to work for 120 full day or 20 hours per week part time. Next is our master program. Yeah, so. Again, we also ask the students to provide their bachelor degree certificate or professional certificate or graduate certificate. And then also a transcript of record showing that minimum overall GPA is 50% plus the grading scale or system. So usually when you uh, receive your transcript at the back page, there is also a grading scale. So for example, if you get like a you know, for example, like 80 out of 100 is equivalent to A, equivalent to satisfactory. So this kind of grading scale system that we want to also uh, get a copy of it so that we can see, you know, your overall GPA. And then copy of international passport, resume or CV. Again, English test is the same for bachelor or master. We also require the students to have the English test. 
uh, the English language proficiency certificate. And then also work experience certificate. This is only applicable for certain programs that require work experience. So not all of our program require work experience, but for those who need work experience that you have to provide work experience certificate. Later on, you can click here, like what kind of certificate that we require. Please uh, note that offered position letter, acceptance letter, resignation letter, pay slips, work contract are not considered as a work experience certificate. Yeah, and this is also very important that work experience must be done after the students finish bachelor degree. So, uh, so if you have like a part-time job or you're doing an internship while you are studying your bachelor, will not be counted as a work experience. Yeah. Okay, so these are the following programs not required work experience, but required related study field. For example, Master of Science, Computer Science, two years. MA International Management, two years, and also Master of Engineering and Management, 60 CTS or one year program. So for more detail, you can always consult with, uh, with expert education, like which program you want to apply, is there any work experience required and so on and so forth, they will be more than happy to guide you. Again, MBA. So this is also, of course, we require for the bachelor degree certificate, transcript of record plus grading scale, copy of international passport, resume, English test, as well as work experience. Yeah, And then the difference between MBA one year and MBA one and a half year. So as I explained uh, briefly before, so to start with our one year MBA, you will have to acquire 210 ECTS credit or four year bachelor program. But if you want to apply for one and a half year, you must have at least three year a bachelor program. But again, we also have a lot of students who are eligible to apply for one year, but they want to do one and a half year. Why? Because they also want to do the specializations within the MBA one and a half year programs. Okay, so another important thing here is the German block account. I'm sure that you've heard before that if you want to study in Germany, you have to transfer a certain amount of money to the government. Yes, this is true uh, because this is uh, it serves as a proof of financial resources when applying for a German student visa. This is like a proof to the German government that you are able to pay for your living while you're studying in Germany. The amount has been set up by the government. So it's 11,208 euro to cover your living expenses for one year. Yeah. And uh, you can send the money to these two, you know, uh, third party companies that are approved by the government. So either Fintiba or Expatrio. So you transfer this amount of money to this uh, two, uh, uh, one of two uh, companies, and then they will freeze your money. They will issue the certificate and then you bring the certificate along with other required documents to the German embassy to apply for your visa. Without having this block account, you will not get your visa issued. Why? Again, because the government wants to see that you have, you know, um, the certain funding to be able to pay for your living in Germany. This also means that your parent doesn't need to show their bank account for three months or six months. No, the most important thing is you have to create this block account. Uh, after you get, you know, offer letter from IU, after you pay a deposit to IU and we will issue you the letter of admission and then you will start to create this block account and then start to up applying your visa at the German embassy. So these are the easy steps that uh, you see the diagram here. So transfer cash of this amount to block account, look for student dormitory, file a visa, submit documents, visa get approved, you arrive in Germany, and then you register at the city hall to get your residence permit, and then open a German saving account, and then you get your money back from this block account, you will get your money back 934 euro monthly. So if you, I calculate this amount times 12 if the same is the same with 11,208. So you actually don't lose your money. Yeah. Uh, once you arrive in Germany, they will send the money back every month to your bank account. 
Okay. Okay, so I think this is the last slide. So this is like the six uh, easy steps to submit applications to IU. First, receive start to finish agent guidance and support. And then start your applications with your agent, with education expert. And then you receive the offer letter or confirmation letter. You reserve study place and transfer campus fee. And then you sign tuition contract, receive the letter of admissions. And then you receive your visa, you arrive in Germany, and you start your study at IU. Okay, so now we are having the Q&A session. So I'm going to stop sharing my screen here. So I'm back to the uh, expert education. So are you going to translate first, or can we go to the uh, Q&A session? Yes, yeah. Can we go to the Q&A session? Yes. Okay. This all Great. And understand English well. Absolutely. Okay, brilliant, brilliant. Happy to know that. Okay, so feel free to ask me any questions. So I think we have a Waso Tuntun. Do I pronounce oh, your name you, correctly? Yeah, you did. Thank you. Uh, hello, I just want to ask a oh, question yeah. about the, the admission yeah. requirement. So I just, I'm going to get my diploma for my grade 12. Uh, I'm studying at an international school and mm -hmm. I'm going to get my 12th grade diploma this month. And as soon as I, is that qualified for, for me to attend the IU University? Okay, so uh, thank you, uh, Waso, for your question. So uh, our admission will be more than happy to assess your qualifications i cannot tell you now uh probably if you can let me know because you said that you studied in international schools am i right yeah is it like an ib school or a level uh, school or maybe ontario American, American school American okay State. yeah okay so american school okay so uh, because I'm not from the uh, academic and admission team, but I'm sure that, you know, our admission team will be able to assess uh, thoroughly your uh, uh, applications. They are going to see like your qualification, they're going to see your grade. And, and if everything meets our requirement, we will be more than happy to offer you a place to study with us. Either maybe you have to start once with Pathway or you can jump direct into our bachelor. But uh, our admission team will assess it and then they will let you know. Okay. Uh, where can I contact the, the uh, admission team? Uh, no, uh, the, you, you are going, you, you need to apply via expert education. So they will help you to submit your applications and then uh, your agency expert education will be in touch with our uh, admission team. So they will oh. they will submit your application on your behalf. They will ask you to uh, to 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 provide all of the required documents, and then they will submit an official application, and then uh, they will in touch with our admission team and myself. So, so you don't have to do it. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It was another question in the chat box. He is a Finnish Bachelor of Engineer in. Never agriculture, he can join to the religion master. Sorry, say it again. He completed bachelor, bachelor of degree engineering in agriculture. In agriculture, okay. Mm -hmm. And he then can, and then he, he joined the master program, religion master program. He can directly join to the this master program. Yes, they can apply for master program depending on which master program he or she is applying. Five year. Five year. Yes, finish five year bachelor program. Yeah, yeah, five year bachelor program is good, so we can accept. But again, as I mentioned before, certain programs require a specific requirement. For example, their work experience. Number two, uh, do we uh, do we require the students who have like um, a similar uh, background for their bachelor or not? And then also we want to see their English language proficiency. So theoretically, yes, we can accept because this is a five-year bachelor program to our master. But then we also have to see other admission requirements as well. So if it meets our requirements, 
then we are more than happy to offer a place to study with us. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Okay, any questions? Any other questions? Well, I have one, if you don't mind. Yeah, sure, sure. Okay, um, I want to know like the advantages, the opportunities for um, international, I mean, public university to students and private university students. Are there like any differences for like advantages? Uh, were, in, like, oh yeah, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I would say that the advantages will be the same uh, regardless if you study in public or, or private university because the uh, job seeking visa or the uh, uh, the stay back options are applicable for all international students. Yeah, as long as you complete your degree in Germany, either in English, either in German, public or private university, it doesn't matter. Because we, IU, even though we are a private university, but we are a state accredited. So at least it means that we have the same quality as our public university here. I would, I would say that uh, the if you study in a public university, uh, because everything, if it's a bachelor program, mostly they are, I would say 99% are delivered in German. So they have yeah. to, so you have to learn a German language first. And then you have to achieve the B2 level first for you in order to be able to do the pathway with them. And then after pathway, you will be able to do a bachelor. So it will take a longer time. But with us, because we are offering everything in English, 100% in English, we just look at your qualification. Even if you are from the international you know, uh, schools, we may be able to give you English waiver so you don't have to sit in ISO 24. But that the admission will confirm about that. And then you can go direct to our, either direct to our bachelor, or if you still need pathway, you will go first to pathway. But you don't have to learn this German language proficiency, you know, because everything is in English. I think this is also like a, a, a additional like point plus if you join IU, uh, a private university, which are offering everything in English. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. I think I got a question from Brian. Can I attend Cambridge A level in IU Berlin campus? Okay. So the uh, Cambridge A level is only available online, Brian. So it's not available for on campus program. So if you not, if you do not, let's say, if you do not finish your high school and if you want to, uh, uh, study bachelor with us that's possible but then you also have to do this a level integrated programs uh, so you will do it concurrently but this is only available online this is not available on campus okay thank you and another one is hand mm -hmm. yeah I think we have like a min tk here oh. Oh yeah, um, I also found that uh, online class, uh, online studies are a lot cheaper than on campus study. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I want to stay in Germany, so I want to know if it is possible to study online while staying in Germany. Is that possible, or do you have any, uh, you know, like hybrid study option? Mm. Okay, thank you for your question, Min. Yes, uh, it is true that our online program is cheaper than on campus because the students will not get a lot of supports and benefits uh, uh, when they are coming on campus. Remember, the, ca the career service will give more support. You can also get your uh, free German classes and also the tutorial face-to-face -face with our professor. That's why on-campus students pay more than online. So. Regarding the hybrid model, you start first with online and then you will uh, later on uh, uh, graduate in Germany. Uh, there will be an opportunity for this hybrid, but it's still not available at the moment. So I'm going to uh, inform education expert if you are in, uh, interested in this kind of hybrid model. Uh, when uh, it is available for you to apply, then I will definitely let you know. But for now, it's only available either you do it fully online 
or fully on campus with us. But you also have to remember, I uh, mean, uh, the difference between doing fully online and fully on campus in Germany is if you graduated fully online, you will not get opportunity to apply for the stay back options. Yeah, even though the degree will be the same from IU, but you cannot go to the German embassy and say, hey, I graduated from IU, a German university, state accredited. Can I get a job uh, seeking visa? No. But if you do it on campus, you will be able to apply for this job seeking visa. Oh, okay. I got it. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Any other questions? So I want to uh, underline once again, so our uh, discounted tuition fee is applicable to every international student. All you have to do is just submit your applications and then we will assess if you meet our requirement that we will definitely offer you this uh, discounted you know, a tuition fee, yeah? Uh, uh, if you don't mind, I have <laughs> one question. Mm -hmm. uh, no I've, problem. Yeah, I uh, finished my degree in business administration, but mm -hmm. uh, I'm thinking about changing my career into IT fields. So I uh, found that you have a master in IT management, but uh, it's kind of like a different background, you know, so. Uh, yeah. Uh, do I what do I need to prepare for this kind of course course? Okay, so you are interested in master of IT management. Okay, so we are going to uh, so please provide all of the required documents. So your bachelor degree certificate and also your transcript, a grading skill system, a CV, and also your English language proficiency certificate. And then you uh, submit it to the uh, education expert and then they will submit the application to, uh, on behalf of you. And then our admission will assess your qualifications because there are, as I mentioned to you, there are certain programs that require the students to come from the same uh, background. So yeah. for example, but then there is also a program. So if you are not, uh, for example, if you are not eligible for this, a master of IT management, but you will be offered to the similar master of IT management. Let's say, let's say if you are not eligible for our M, uh, master IT management uh, program, we will we will probably uh, this is only for example, yeah. I mean, we will probably uh, offer you a place to study in our master international management with IT management specialization. Oh. You know what I mean. So we will always see, that's why I cannot make a decision because I don't see your qualifications, but our mm -hmm. admission will assess the role. And okay. then if you are eligible to, uh, to get a place to your, uh, your, uh, your, your master program that you want to study, but if not, we will always offer you to the similar, the closest you know, master program that would interest you also to study. Okay, okay? thank you. Thank you. Okay. Do we have any other questions? Ms. Adnan, I think they don't have a question. Okay. Okay, excellent. So uh, I think we can end the webinar today. So I will be more than happy to share the presentation so you guys can have a look uh, and then you can always, you know, uh, you know, get a lot of, you know, advice and support from the education expert as well. And then once you have everything ready, you know, just submit the applications uh, via education expert. And then we will be more than happy to assess your applications. And if everything is good, we are happy to have you to come and study, you know, with us in Germany, either in Berlin or in Bad Hohenheim. Okay, I will send you the PowerPoint presentation. So once again, thank you very much. 
And I'm looking forward to seeing you guys in Germany. Thank you. Have Thank a good you. day. Have a good day. Thank you for your presentation. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.